Assessment criteria 4.1 is identify research sources. Ian, do you want to talk a bit about this? Sure. So on this page, you can see three research sources that they've identified and used. In the first instance, the one Vanderbilt, we've got Vanderbilt, 2010. We know that's from a website because we just have a, a, a page number here. The second citation we've got is from the VNA, I and mean, it's got comma 2013 and a colon 98. So we know that this is a book because they've included the page number of where they got the quote or idea from. And it's very important to put the page number if you're using a book. And then obviously if you've got a website, you don't have a page number, so you can't put one. The final citation on the page we've just highlighted there is from Wikipedia. I think what we probably would say is, it's, Wikipedia is a good place to start your research, but there's, if you're looking up for a concept like this on modernism, you probably find some really good uh, web pages on any kind of gallery like the VNA or the Tate, would you say? Yeah, you? absolutely. So this essay has been Harvard referenced. So what that means is, in the text, by the quote or the idea, we have the author and the year and the page number in it, if there is one. And then all of those citations link to the bibliography, which appears at the end of the essay, where you have the full details of the, the source that's being used. Um, you can see this bibliography here. It's not quite been ordered in the correct um, format because it needs to be in alphabetical. So we would have uh, BBC and Burge and Boyne at the start and the rest of the uh, citations would follow in an alphabetical order. By looking at the bibliography here, you can see they've got a really good mix of websites, but also a number of books that they've found there. There's a book there, the V&A Gallery of Fashion, that they would have found in the library. So do check the library catalogue, because you will find books and journals and TV programmes that are relevant to the, the topics for this essay, uh, as well as looking at websites as well. If you're unsure how to uh, Harvard reference, um, there is a link to the Harvard Referencing Guide um, which will appear um, by this uh, 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 screencast in my UCA or you can just ask in the library and we'll be more than happy to help you. And finally, assessment criteria 4.2, apply research skills to develop own learning. A good example of this in this particular essay is the conclusion that's highlighted where the students quite clearly discussing what they've learnt, summarising uh, what they've learnt uh, discussing some of the ideas that they've been involved with, uh, given some, uh, just summed up the examples that they've used.